Hi everyone, thanks for joining us for another episode uh, where we're gonna show you how to use Miralink in Audi. Technically you can use it in any cars with the head unit double DIN, single DIN with RCA and HDMI inputs. So let's go over the wiring which comes with the kit and first we're gonna start with power cable which you know just basic wire with three wires in it red yellow and and black ground so technically with our application if you connect to cars gadget uh, rear view camera interface you will connect to these wires is red acc out b plus and ground and you will connect them together by color red to red yellow to yellow and black to black but you also have a choice to connect it to get a power through this USB cable where you can connect it to um, either your cigarette lighter or um, if your car equipped with USB charger you can plug it in there. You also have a choice with this wire to connect it directly to the fuse box where you will connect yellow wire to the fuse where there is a constant power. A red wire you will connect to the fuse that have a power when you turn on the ignition and black wire you just connect to the ground to any bare metal under the bolt. Also for the Audi application you will need this cable what calls AMI to RCA which connects in the glove box. Some Audis have this connector either in the glove box or in the armrest. So just look around your car and then you will determine how to run the wire, what, what's the easier way and where you want to install the mirror link itself. Let's look at the mirror link box. Taking it out of the box you will notice there is a few plugs in the mirror link itself. Um, on the back you'll find a power connector where you plug in this wire only if you will connect it to the car's power. You don't need it if you will be connecting it to USB connector or also I forgot to mention with this power you can connect to uh, any battery pack and it can kind of will become a portable unit where you can take it on the go connect it to the battery pack and you will connect HDMI you connect HDMI to the TV and you can stream it directly to the TV from your phone just being on the go you know in a hotel for PowerPoint presentations name it Right to the power connector you will find the AV out audio video. This is where you connect this cable. Uh, it goes right there and then all this three you will connect. Yellow it's gonna be your video and white and red that would be your left and right audio. Uh, again if it's in the Audi you will need to plug it in into AMI to RCA cable the audio right here you'll connect it to your AMI box in the glove box or in armrest and then yellow one you will connect to our interface unit front video input okay moving along on the front side you will find USB connector that's that's where you will connect your phone also if you decide to connect to a um, cigarette lighter or any battery pack, you, as I said, you will use white cable. Uh, another, you'll find the audio in, where you technically can plug in any device with uh, audio out with a 3.5 audio jack, but it also will require to connect your Android. Unfortunately, the Android users need to use this cable in conjunction with uh, regular USB cable. Uh, for some reason, Android phones cannot transmit the sound through the USB cable. So you will need to connect both cables to the Android devices. And then we'll find HDMI out. That, that's where you can plug into TV, uh, monitor, your auto market double DIN head unit as the HDMI, then you can connect it there. So let's see how it actually works on the screen. As I already showed in my previous video, I installed uh, mirror link right behind the climate control panel. So it's hidden right there. All I have just this small wire sticking out where I connect uh, USB and iPhone lighting cable. We simply plug it in to your uh, iPhone. When you first connect your iPhone um, to the mirror link, 
you'll see the message pop up here asking you to trust this computer. You press trust and you'll be able to use your iPhone right away. When you connect phone to USB cable, you will need to turn media to AUX. Just simply go through your uh, applications and find media AUX on the screen. And then press and hold now button for three seconds and it will go to the iPhone mode. Then when you rotate your phone into the horizontal position, uh, all the applications will be in the horizontal view. Then you can go, any application you open on your phone will be projecting on your LCD screen in the car. And we can use Waze. Okay, here is the Waze. Uh, we can use YouTube. I was just watching a video how to use DSLR. But just go, let's find one of our videos. Before using the Miralink, I was using this, probably all Audi owners know what it is, tune to air Bluetooth transmitter. It's such a piece of, you know what it is, you know, like all the time gave me that error that it just synchronizing something, was disconnecting, customer service is terrible. I tried to write them like, I don't know, five times on the Amazon. I didn't get any response from them, zero, no, no customer service at all. So I just get tired and we, as the Audi owners, we just got stuck with it because it's the only one device was working at the time uh, with Audis. I tried to buy from different suppliers, they didn't work. So that's the only device worked, actually worked, but eventually it, it doesn't because it's just like terrible, terrible thing. So I don't know if you guys have same issues, please comment below, let me know what's your experience with that small Bluetooth thing. But for me it didn't, I mean it, it works, but like so many times gave me that error and I have to connect, reconnect in the glove box, like which makes pain in the ass. And as well, you can uh, stream any radio from your phone and if you don't need to look at the screen for video, let's say you're listening to the radio Let's play something. You press and hold now button again to turn the screen off. You go to the original screen when you can navigate your climate control, see everything on the screen and you still can hear the radio. So you just charge and it's kind of extra step. You sit in the car, you plug in the cable, but then same thing, you stream the radio, you stream music from your phone, watch the video or something, you uh, hold the now button, you go to the mirror link screen, unlock your phone and you can browse through the phone and see all the applications on the screen. Little nobody has clearly lost his little mind. So this is, was a quick overview of the mirror link. If you like the video, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, stay tuned for new cool devices coming up. Thank you and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.